Well, with more rain on the way, be careful when you're driving. Roads can be slick. Nine on your side. Corey Marshall continues. Nine on your side. Team coverage tonight live at Grant and Alvernon. Valerie, as you can see, the road behind me is dried up. But just to give you some perspective, if you were out here a couple of hours ago, this intersection behind me was completely flooded. Now, as we said, things are dried up until the next system moves in. Rain and lots of it. Nine in your side drove around town. In some spots, drivers couldn't avoid the flooding. The downpour and puddles canceled any race plans for these guys. Some are taking it better than others. This one on the first race today. Umberto Bayek drove from El Paso to Tucson for today's races at the Rito. Horses in tow, he had several registered for this weekend's races. We're just waiting here to see if it's going to be can canceled for tomorrow also. Mm -hmm. If it is, we'll head back home. Bayek realizes the six-hour road trip to Tucson could be a complete wash. Fuel, horses, you know putting up for them and everything to get them here. It is a long way to not race. Yes, yes. Yeah, so now it's just the waiting game? That's all it is. Inside the Tucson International Airport, weather delayed several flights. Romyar Sharifi is also playing the waiting game. Showers delayed his friend's flight from San Diego. It kind of sucks, so we'll get a slower start on things. and. No hiking, what with the, the rain. With this soggy weather expected to last all weekend, some people are just fine without the sunshine. I'm from Australia, a land of different climates, so I'm, I'm okay with that. Now, as you heard April say, more rain is on the way. As we mentioned, things are dried up now, but that might not be the case the next time you head out. So check for the areas of flooding, and if you can, plan ahead for alternate routes. Valerie. Well, Cor uh, Corey, you were around town all day. Did you see a lot of wrecks? We did. Most of them were spinoffs, which is a good reminder that it hasn't rained in a while. So a lot of that oil is getting picked up, which makes roads slick. Yeah, and you can't see it as well. All right.